Okay, so please start solving this. You have to prove LHS is equal to RHS. So please solve the LHS here and let me know if you are able to do. Okay, who has done it? The LHS? See, it's not that tough. Abdullah, have you tried? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, have you got it? No, ma'am, but I am about to finish. Okay. Martin, any progress? Doing.
See, it's not that tough. Okay, let me also solve it. First of all, you can see it is a plus b whole square, right? So you have to open the bracket. Otherwise, you cannot add it. So this is the, you know, a plus b whole square is a square plus b square plus 2ab, right? So this first bracket will become sine square theta plus cosac square theta plus 2 sine theta into cosac theta, right? First bracket. Similarly, second one, cos square theta plus sec square theta plus 2 cos theta and sec theta. Okay. Uh, now this is sine square theta plus cosac square theta plus 2 sine theta. Now this cosac theta can be written as 1 upon sine theta so that we can cancel it. And here cos square theta plus sec square theta plus 2 cos theta. Similarly, here we can write 1 upon cos theta. Okay, so this sine theta, sine theta will cancel out. Uh, so it becomes sine square theta plus cosac square theta plus 2 only, right? And then plus cos square theta plus sec square theta plus 2. All right. Now, this is simple plus in between. So, you can remove the bracket. It's just addition. Uh, so, this sine square theta and this cos square theta can be clubbed together. So, I'm writing sine square theta plus cos square theta. And then you have cosac square theta plus sac square theta plus and 2 and 2 will become 4, right? Now, this sine square theta plus cos square theta will become 1. Plus, you have cosec square theta plus sec square theta plus 4, right? Now, as you can see, right hand side, you have tan and cot. That means you have to change this cosec and sec. All right? Okay. So, now this 1 plus 4 will become 5. So, I'm writing 5 here. Plus, this cosec square theta can be written as 1 plus cot square theta. Now, sec square theta will be 1 plus tan square theta, right? Now, this is 5 plus 1, 6 plus 1, 7 and plus tan square theta plus cot square theta, which is equal to RHS. Yes, Abdullah. Were you able to do this? Oh my, my, I did something else. Mm. Okay, so next one. See, this one came in CBSC 2000 also, 2019 also. So this kind of questions will come. You need more practice. Anyway, one more I'm giving you now. Please try this. Okay, try this. I have no question. Yes, Martin. I always like it become tan one plus tan square theta. Uh, sorry, where? Uh, yeah, step below that thing. Here, yeah, it's an identity, Martin. One plus 
cot square theta is equal to cosec square theta, right? Yeah. Okay, and then one plus sec square theta is equal to ten. So yeah, one one right. Uh, just one minute, Margaret. Okay. Yeah, sorry, Martin. I had a call actually. Okay. Uh, yeah. There's only one one, right? So how? Just one minute. Let me just erase it. I think I'm also confused. Uh, I think after this step, you are confused, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So here I'll use this identity. Sorry, I think I wrote it wrong. One plus tan square theta is equal to sac square theta, right? And then one plus oh. cot square theta is cosac square theta. So these are the two identities. You know them. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So I'm just replacing them. Cosac square theta. I'm writing one plus cot square theta. And sec square theta, I'm writing 1 plus tan square theta. Right? And this 1 and this 4, I'm adding together. So it becomes 5 plus. Now this cosec square theta will become 1 plus cot square theta. Plus, now this sec will become 1 plus tan square theta. So now if you open the bracket, so you have 5 plus 1 plus one so that becomes seven and plus cos square theta plus tan square theta okay now try the next one See here, uh, you can start like this. You have sec square theta, then sec 4 theta. So you can take one sec square theta common from these two terms. And similarly here, you can take cosec square theta common and then you can proceed.
Yes, Martin, any progress? We're doing well. Abdullah. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, are you doing it? Yeah, ma'am. Okay. Okay, one step I'm doing, then you can proceed further, right, Martin? Yeah, ma'am. See, first, uh, as you can see, from the first two terms, you can take sac square theta common, right? So you're left with two and then minus sec square theta, okay? Now, uh, now be careful with sign. One term is minus and one is plus. So if you're taking minus outside and then cosec square theta. So the first term will be two and this one will become minus, okay? Because you're taking minus outside. So it will be cosec square theta. Arshia, is that okay? All right. Um, now, your, your RHS is in the terms of cot and tan. So that, that means you have to replace sac and cosac. So you use the same identity which we used earlier, right? So this sac square theta, now I'm writing 1 plus tan square theta, okay? Multiplied by 2 minus and Okay, so this is now big bracket and then a small bracket. So sec square theta is one plus tan square theta. Okay, minus. So this cosec square, I'm writing one plus cot square theta, then two minus, then small bracket. This cosec square theta is one plus cot square theta. Uh, now open the bracket first of all. So 1 plus tan square theta and this becomes 2 minus 1 and then minus tan square theta. All right. Okay, then minus 1 plus cot square theta and here it becomes 2 minus 1 minus of cot square theta. So this is one plus tan square theta into, now two minus one is one. So one minus tan square theta and minus one plus cot square theta. And this is one minus cot square theta. 
Now, if you look at this carefully, so it is looking like a plus b into a minus b, right? It's much. Right? Yeah, yeah. So a plus b into a minus b is a square minus b square. So this becomes like one square minus 10 square theta whole square. Understand? A square minus b square. And then similarly here, so this will be one square minus cos square theta whole square. Right? So a square minus b square. So this becomes one minus. 10 4 theta and then minus this is 1 minus cot 4 theta understand now open the bracket so 1 minus 10 4 theta and this is minus 1 and then minus minus plus cot 4 theta so 1 1 cancel out and this is cot 4 theta and minus of 10 4 theta which is your RHS Okay, so uh, like listen to this very carefully. Now, there are only few identities, hardly three identities you are using in this chapter, right? So don't be scared. You, you are using only this much. And just we have used one plus 10 square theta is sec square theta and one plus cot square theta is cosec square theta. Rest is all calculation. If you are doing it very carefully, the plus, minus and everything, you will get the answer. Getting it? Yes, hmm. So I'm writing one more question here. Now you solve this. This is not that difficult. So sine theta upon 1 minus cos theta plus 10 theta upon sac theta cosac theta Okay, so you take LCM first of all and then solve it, okay?
Arshia, any progress? Yes, ma'am, do I? Abdullah, have you got it? No, 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 no. Okay, so I think there's no progress here, right? Let us solve it. Okay, solve it. Square in this. 
Hmm, sorry. Okay. Okay, now solve it with me. So in the first step, I'm solving our LHS. I'm taking LCM, right? So that is one minus of cos theta into one plus cos theta. So here I get uh, sine theta multiplied by one plus cos theta and then plus. So this is tan theta into one minus of cos theta, right? Yeah. So, hmm, should I multiply? Okay, let's keep it same. So sine theta into one plus cos theta. And then, okay, so tan, theta into one minus of cos theta. Now the denominator is again a minus b into a plus b. So it is a square minus b square. So that means one minus cos square theta, right? Okay. Now one minus cos square theta is sine square theta. So in the next step you have one plus cos theta and then plus tan theta into one minus cos theta. And this one minus cos square theta is sine square theta. So as we know, sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to one, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so if you split the terms now, so this is sine theta into one plus cos theta and then divided by sine square theta. Similarly, tan theta into one minus cos theta and then divided by sine square theta. Okay, so here one sine will get canceled. So you get one plus cos theta and then divided by sine theta plus. Now convert this tan. So tan is sine theta upon cos theta. Okay, so you get sine theta into one minus cos theta and then sine theta upon cos theta and then into sine square theta. So I've changed tan theta into sine theta by cos theta. Okay. Mm. Let us further split this. Okay, in the next step I'll do cos theta and then upon sine theta. And here, so one sine will get canceled out and you have one minus cos theta divided by sine theta cos theta. All right? Uh, what is the uh, hmm. tan theta change to sine theta? Uh, tan theta is sine theta divided by cos theta. So this sine theta by cos theta is tan theta. Okay. And the other terms are same. Okay, so you can split it now. So this is one upon sine theta and plus cos theta upon sine theta, okay? Similarly, you can split these two terms. So one upon sine theta cos theta and minus cos theta divided by sine theta cos theta, okay? Now, uh, Okay, so one upon sine theta plus, so cos theta by sine theta will become cot theta plus. Now this is one upon sine theta, that means cos theta and one upon cos theta is sac theta minus. So here cos will get canceled out and this is one upon sine theta. So this term will get canceled out and you are left with cot theta plus Cosac theta, sac theta, which is your RHS. Right? Now, one more question I'm giving you, which is a similar question. Same way you have to do, take LCM and solve it. So sine theta and divided by 
1 plus cos theta plus 1 plus cos theta upon sine theta. This is equal to 2 cos theta. Now, please try it. It's not very difficult.
Yes, Martin. Have you done it? I'm trying now. Okay. Abdullah, what about you? This one is very easy. Yes, Abdullah. Mm. Okay, now see this, okay? LHS. So one plus cos theta into sine theta will be the LCM. So this becomes sine square theta plus, and this becomes one plus cos theta whole square, right? Now you cannot add it because you have A plus B whole square formula. So you have to expand this bracket first of all. So sine square theta plus, now this is a square plus b square plus 2ab. So 1 plus cos square theta plus 2 cos theta, right? And divided by 1 plus cos theta into sine theta. Okay, so now this is simple addition. So you can open the bracket. And then you can combine this sine square theta plus cos square theta, right? So you get yeah. one. So you get oh, one. Okay. There's, there is another one. So you get two plus two cos theta and divided by one plus cos theta into sine theta. Now, if you take two common, you have one plus cos theta and divided by one plus cos theta into sine theta. So this whole bracket cancels out and you have 2 upon sine theta, which is 2 cosec theta. That's it. Was it that difficult? Yeah, I was in the uh, step before this, but I can oh. figure out what to do after this. Okay. So my analysis is uh, that you people require a lot of practice, I think, for trigonometric identities. Right, Abdullah? Yes. See the questions which I'm giving you here in practice. They earlier came in CBSC. I'm picking out only those questions. So this is the level of question which is going to come. And you, I mean, you yourself are realizing that you are struggling with the questions, okay? So yeah. uh, I think uh, let's decide some homework. Both of you are having Adi Sharma book. So I'm giving you some homework from there, right? Yeah. So Adi Sharma, this is exercise number, I'm telling you. 11.1. 11.1, 1, trigonometric identities.
so exercise is having around uh, 40 41 questions so first 10 or first 15 questions can you try as a homework okay, please try to solve all the 15 questions at least and if you can solve more it's good 15 or 20 questions and so that we can discuss in the next class wherever you get stuck so that's your homework right mm -hmm. Okay, then uh, we will meet in the next class and please do the homework. There's no point sitting here and. Okay. Uh, yeah, please. Okay. Okay, Martin. Bye. Thank you, Martin. Hello, Rida. Can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, Rida, how was your exam? I think you were having a test. Yeah. It was good, ma'am. It was good. Okay. So, anyway, today, okay, Harsha is also coming. Just wait. Yes, Harsha, my audible? Yes, ma'am. Okay. 